all the interactions are about where I could drink, who I could drink with. In fact, I made decisions about not going places until I knew that, oh, there was, you know, alcohol going to be there. Oh, okay, then I'll show up. And if you have a family member that is also in that same boat, because usually when there's one, there's two or three, um, it's not safe for us in the beginning to be around that person. I was taught in the beginning, you check your motives, all right? If you go to the barber shop every day, you'll get a haircut eventually. And I heed that warning very seriously. What is my motivation to hang out with this person? Are we celebrating somebody's birthday? Are we, you know, doing something that's going to be good for the entire family? If it's, you know, meet them at the bar because that's where they feel the most comfortable, then yeah, you have to kind of walk away. I'm not saying you walk away from your family forever, but there is definitely times in our early recovery and sometimes even in mid recovery where we are not at our best that we need not hang out with those people.